And uh, now P did it, you know, a day later he goes golfing, right? Mm -hmm. so, so like, do you really think that, how does P Diddy get out of this? Like, does he come out on the other side okay? He got billion dollars. We know he had it. What they charging him with? They ain't charging him with nothing yet. You know what I'm saying? They turn, what is that a damn? What is it? They turn every black man down. If they, if they not, if a black man not selling dope, he ain't doing nothing illegal. They turn him down by saying how freaky he is. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. Yeah, we gonna talk. Wow. As you, they talk about, um, I don't know, this came up on my head whenever mm -hmm. you're talking about how she lost her baby daddy and stuff like that. Did you see that article about that woman who, um, her baby daddy is out there in the streets and whatever, and she called, and she, no, she made a post and said where he was, uh -huh. and said, because <clears throat> I think he was into it with some other gangs or whatever, mm -hmm. and said, I don't understand why he ain't been got yet. This is this, so she like on the slide said, he always at X, Y, Z at this address. <laughs> I can't understand how comes he had never gotten, you know, murked, whatever. Uh -huh. And he did. They went and got him. Did you see that? Yes, yeah, yeah. What you think about a baby mama like that? Uh, you got to watch these girls. These girls, these girls got a lot of, it's a lot of drama, even with the Mo3 situation. I watched the girl watch and make her baby daddy jealous of a Mo3. He sat outside the whole time, and, and then he killed him, and then the baby mama snitch on him. You got to watch these girls. Because that girl wanted her baby daddy out of her life. It, she said it. Yeah, yeah. She did that. She should be contempt for murder, too. But these baby daddies got to stand up, though, because sometimes sometimes these these, these mamas, these ba see, listen, and this was wrong with, you got to watch a woman and say, I want to, that now women are saying they want babies instead of I want to be married. I watch yeah, a lot of young women, I always say that, well, I want a baby. You don't want to be married? You don't want a ring? Nah, you got me fucked up. Think I'm gonna let my daughters do this. But look at you. You ain't married. No, uh, yeah. And you got baby mamas. I understand that, but see. So you fell for the okie doke. Uh, yeah, because at the end of the day, I was lost. You understand what I'm saying? I got, I had four, four kids and yeah, since Mo three died. I was lost. So you're found now. Yeah, I'm found now because so I'm, the one that you went, you I'm, gonna marry. Yeah, I'm trying to. I'm, I'm, I'm watching the, I'm watching these kids grow and I'm looking in their eyes and I'm sitting there, I'm, I'm sitting there, sitting there saying. I can't keep doing foolish shit. Like, I be up all night drinking and and really just um. How old are you now? Uh, thirty four. I really just uh. Uh, the last three years, I've been miserable. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I'm really could be miserable a lot because I don't care about how much money you get. You still have you still be miserable. I've been miserable because really my partner gone, and then I got I go to my one of my rooms. I see Roy Lee now. And you know what I'm saying? So, you know. Um, Have you tried to go on counseling? Uh uh. Why? Because uh, counseling, it's just, li it's just life lessons. Have you tried it though? Uh <clears throat> Like, when I was miserable and broke and I went to prison, prison I ain't need no damn counseling. I, I need prayer. So, you know, you just got to get your connection back, you know. But I have been lost. I was lost. Like, I was lost. I can tell that you you really you 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 know I always say you got a good heart when it come down to God. You speak a mm -hmm. lot of godly things, bro. I do know that you you try. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's all we can ask, really. Yeah, I was a dumbass though. One time, one time, I took forty thousand dollars in the strip club and went in there and threw about five to ten thousand dollars and went to church and gave and gave God two hundred dollars of my tithes. Mm. The fuck am I doing out here? Man, let me ask you something. I gotta How get many you. people do that? No, no. Yeah. let me let me get you. Let me get, let me get you. Let me get, let me get you right here, man. Uh, I gotta go back to Diddy, man. They got a little white guy that they saying he was a mule. Like he took he took the uh, some kind of way they, when they busted everybody, he got caught with a little work. And uh, now P did it. You know, a day later he goes golfing, right? Mm -hmm. So so like, do you really think that? How does P Diddy get out of this? Like, does he come out on the other side okay? He got billion dollars. We know he had it. What they charging him with? They ain't charging him with nothing yet. You know what I'm saying? They turn, what is that a damn? What is it? They turn every black man down. If they, if they not, if a black man not selling dope, and he ain't doing nothing illegal. They turn him down by saying how freaky he is. Black niggas freaky. You hear me? Like we freaky. 
<laughs> like, 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 like at the end of the day, so they did Bill Cosby like that. They couldn't, they couldn't, they couldn't get him for nothing else but being a freak. R. Kelly, R. Kelly, being a freak. Now they, now you can't. Uh, P. Diddy, P. Diddy is just a, a big nigga with more money than all them. So to turn him all the way down, they saying he gay. They said he was he, he was he was raping little boy. He was raping no, he wasn't he raping little boys. They put the little boys on Michael Jackson. They said he was freaky about the little boys. They never never came out. So now on on uh, on P Diddy, they go say that he gay. See that see you could be the biggest snitch in the world. You don't have to take care of your kids. You ain't got to do shit in life. In the black community, if you say you gay, that fuck up your whole reputation. Damn. You know what I'm saying? So 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 that's the worst thing you can say about a nigga is he gay? Like if a nigga can walk in here right now, and you can say yeah, right. He, he told on he told on ten people, uh, ten, ten people. Like, What's up with you, bro? Nigga gone about business. Ain't got nothing to do with me. But if he say yeah, right, he fucked ten mans in the ass. I'm sitting there looking at him like that. Nigga, you even touch me? That's the worst thing in the black community to say a man is gay. So at the end of the day, you know, uh, I don't I don't think P Diddy did all that. You don't? No, nah, they trying to turn. He was too. He had too much power. I said, what about all the people he helped, man? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? A billionaire that's having wild parties? Oh, no, nah, you weren't supposed to act like that with a billionaire. What's the difference between him and Hugh Hefner when he was doing it? Hugh Hefner wasn't having... He was having wild parties. He had a lot of people over there. Yeah, yeah but he wasn't... He he had that much money as P. Diddy. He didn't have much P. Diddy, but he had a lot yeah, of wild yeah. parties. Yeah, so... And a lot of... And so, lot, back then, the 70s and stuff, the cocaine was yeah. just living. So, P. Diddy is actually not inviting the right people to the parties. You know what I'm saying? You don't think so? Hell no. He needed he 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 helping was biting the right people to the party that was in there getting free ass. Nigga PD was in there, they was in there charging for ass. All them girls in there were charging for ass. Do you think that Suge Knight, Suge Knight says that they when they came, they looking for stuff to why they, they can try to hide what's going on. They trying to go in there and look and see. They yeah. don't want people to be incriminated, so they trying yeah, to get yeah, all of it. Yeah, they got camera. He said they had cameras in every room. So yeah, they got they probably he probably got the mirror in there getting wild. He can't, so man. you agree with you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I went to a PD party before. What? <clears throat> After the Grammys? 2000. <laughs> what happened in there? Huh? It wasn't that wild, though. I think they had me on one side. <laughs> <laughs> what you think? You wanted to see all the wild stuff. I would look, I would look, I would, you know, I'm in there trying to mack on every hoe. They, they probably thought I was a pimp or something. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, they got. Me. I got out of there fast. So. You get to the P Diddy party. I got you looking because you done heard. Yeah, you done yeah. heard about the Diddy party. Bow Wow, was over here. I, we, I, we, everybody just, you know, it was down hanging out in LA, kicking it. Yeah, go back to y'all to the pool. Everybody just kicking it. You know what I'm saying? But you know, at the end of the day, uh, y'all yeah, were too ghetto. I mean, I was too <laughs> southern. You were too southern. Yeah. <laughs> What about what about Jay? Jay hadn't said nothing. People aren't stepping up for Diddy. I don't see nobody saying anything. Oh, Jay next. Only one they spoke up. I think it was Tyree spoke up. Who else spoke up for Diddy? It was somebody else. Yeah, yeah. I, I, Glasses Malone. He spoke Glasses up. Glasses Malone. It was a few people that spoke up for Slim him. Thugs mentioned something. Too. Slim. Who else? It was a lot of them. That, that but it wasn't the ones that like Mary J or none of them. Yeah, Jay. Jay Nix. Jay Z. Mm -hmm. I'm here. Jay Z and next. Man, watch. I, I give it five to ten years. Something gonna come across him and Beyonce. Ooh, you keep this tape and say Rainwater. You would, and then you do a remember and say Rainwater told y'all. Something gonna happen to him and Beyonce. First they go get divorced, and Jay did all this shit, and and now it's coming back. Watch. It's it, gonna happen. Jay so dope, and you still ain't went to jail in the past. You still owe these people for taxes in, in the eighties. 90s It's time that they they them, they, nigga, they, them people know you don't let you get away with too much shit. Damn, man, Jada, Jada got himself caught up. You think he? He can got age. more than enough money to pay them back if that's the case. Did he did too though? Did he did too. Nah, they don't want your money. They want they want your they want your reputation. They yeah. want your power. Yeah. You give them, you know they they know you got they know you you got money. They power. Listen, P Diddy power was taken away when he and they say he was fucking boys. He. <laughs> I heard that the Ciroc thing was what that, that liquor company, uh, and I heard they moved Jim Iovine according to Suge Knight. Allegedly, they moved Jim Iovine and Dr. Dre into that into that space where P Diddy was already. Yeah. Say so they the new you know faces for this liquor. For Ciroc. Uh, for Ciroc. Ciroc. For, it's a it's a yeah, liquor company. Yeah, it's like, like do you think that really is something that they're doing? But it's like Yeezy, like 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 Kanye. They forgot they just tore him down. They didn't say he was freaky though because they know Kanye keep his shit private. Kanye probably don't party with no. Nobody or nothing, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? And and and, and you he, he got married. He he did the proper steps. 
okay, I'm st- I'm coming up to be one of the most uh, powerful black men in the world, right? So let me go get a white lady. We we'll go marry, go, go do the same thing. Go get protected by Kim Kardashian, have a baby. Come back, you know what I'm saying? I'm doing good in life, you know what I'm saying? Okay, okay, now they still want something. They can't find nothing on you because they can't say you was freaky. They can't say nothing about you. So they 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 come they come and make the black people think that he's the worst person in the world and take his shoes. Damn. It's always somebody. They did Kobe like that. You forgot they did Kobe like that? I remember that. They did Michael Jordan like that. They said that he was the head of gambling problem. What about I see Stevie J stepped up and said he wanted to punch uh, 50, man? Stevie J. Stevie J. Say he want to get in there. He he want to have a ba- a, a bout a fight. a fight because of they said that Stevie J. Allegedly there's a tape going around of him at a, with a man freaky. Yeah, yes, yeah, I ain't that freaky. <laughs> you got to be a nasty motherfucker. That's a legend, man. You got to be a nasty motherfucker. He pissed about it because he didn't like him saying it to get close to another man, but her. Did you hear what I said? He yeah, pissed. I, okay, I'm just sitting there telling you. You got to be nasty. You got to be nasty. He pissed about it. He don't like it. He say 50 cent. He, he really alleged to say 50 to one out here spreading this stuff, man. A grown nigga. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.